But first at five, we do want to talk about a pretty scary scene today in Stockton. A violent crash involving a fire engine this morning caused big headaches for commuters. It led to a busy day for first responders, including four firefighters who were involved in it all. ABC 10's Gabriel Porras has been tracking this story all day, and he has the very latest from Stockton. A gaping hole left in this Stockton home, the impact of a wild Wednesday morning crash involving a sedan, pickup truck, and a Stockton fire engine. A couple of booms and a lot of debris flying all over the place. That was the moment when Stockton police say this red car traveling east on Alpine Avenue was driving through and hit a fire engine headed north to a fire call with lights and sirens on. The driver of the fire engine then crossed over the median, slamming into a pickup truck and landing just beside the home's front door. He was very calm. He says, it's in my house. The home's owner and Carrie were at the cash register inside the gas station across the street when the violent crash unfolded. No one else was inside the house at the time, but at least four firefighters and one person inside the sedan were hurt, suffering from non-life-threatening injuries. The driver of the truck is said to be in critical condition. After that collision, the firefighters did get out and start assessing the scene and providing that necessary first responding uh, attention to everyone involved. It's crazy. Then all the other about five different fire trucks showed up and police officers. West Lane is a usually busy street and with it being closed all day, officers have been diverting hundreds of cars and even some trucks onto residential streets. Everybody's coming right through our neighborhoods and it's it's crazy. Hoping to calm the traffic tensions in the middle of the morning commute, David Krause sprung into action, directing traffic with his neighbors. I got my road flares out in the road and just kind of directing traffic, trying to keep everybody slowed down, like obviously like that. They don't like to slow down through here. But police are hoping people will slow down, not just here, but everywhere to prevent more tragedies. It's so important to not drive distracted or anything like that and just be aware, um, and especially when you see other cars slowing down in an intersection, um, you know, proceed with caution. Yeah, everyone be safe out there. That was our Gabriel Porras reporting. The Stockton police have not said whether there were any factors that played a role in that crash, and that includes speed. Witnesses are asked to call investigators.